So hello everyone, I am Shreyana. Welcome you back in this machine learning tutorial series. So in the previous video, we started with the example of uh, linear uh, like uh, decision tree uh, in on uh, Jupyter notebook. And uh, so in this video as well, we will continue with that. So here we are importing the like uh, decision tree classifier. Uh, as in the previous video. Uh, I have already explained the like what are we are what we are doing in each step, and uh, I think you should also try to uh, like uh, implement your own logic in these uh, uh, in these commands. That's why I have not explained it uh, so much in detail because uh, from the linear regression and logistic regression as well, I'm trying to explain each and every line. So so that's why I'm not going in detail with these. Uh, these commands so you can you can go through these commands at your end also then uh, the things will be more clear because it you will be implementing by your own so now uh, as we have uh, implemented the like decision tree classifier so now uh, i am implementing decision tree regression and after that uh, i am like creating the like model or we can say um, uh, like instance on an object with the with the name of uh, dt underscore model and after that i try to fit the model uh, as we already know that fitting the model means that training the model that is uh, giving the uh, the machine an idea about what is true what is false and what which statement will be called as true and which statement will be called as false and after that uh, I tried uh, to check the training score. Like, what what is the training score that is that machine is scoring? That is 0 0.98 as well. And uh, talking about like uh, on the validation score, uh, checking the result on the validation score as well. Like, um, I think if that is the, the checking that tra training score is that how much result is true in the training score. That is the actual the actual results is how much true. So it is 0 0.98 and talking about validation score it is how much correct is uh, 0 0.75 after that to be applied the prediction on the validation set that is test set uh, validation set is similar as the test set and after that uh, we saw the results in 0 and 1 as you can see and 0 and 1 basically says uh, exactly what we have studied that uh, classifier yes and no and after that i tried to like store uh, the predicted values uh, with one column uh, with taking the one column and uh, after that i tried to like uh, append it using the uh, different uh, commands of uh, like length and uh, uh, like with the help of like array i tried to like uh, give uh, implement it uh, on a tree so after for that i have uh, like i have used this command and after that uh, i have tried to like uh, import the accuracy score that how much accurate uh, our machine is so for that i have like uh, compared the y valid with y new and we got that we are getting 0 0.75 accuracy in the result and uh, after that uh, we are getting uh, i'm trying to implement uh, the uh, like uh, on the basis of the training accuracy, I'm trying to know the depth. Like, what what is the maximum depth that a that a like a result should get? So as we already know, a tree contain on depth like from the root to leaf or from the root to intermediate tree node. There is a difference like uh, in the depth. So for that, I have tried to implement with this with this command. And uh, after that, also I tried to get the data in the frame for frame uh, look and uh, and as you can see uh, here also uh, we have the maximum that that uh, a particular train uh, like uh, train account uh, or we can say test account can have is one two three four five which means that it will be in the root node and this will be in the like uh, uh, child of the root node and after that i tried to, according to the like uh, according to the maximum depth and the uh, depth of the tree and the performance uh, and i tried to plot the feed plot um, the train set and test sets or we can see the valid set value set so you can see we have a blue color shows the train set and uh, 
and the the orange color shows the valid valid test okay and uh, as you can see the difference between these are uh, with, with the range of 0 0.050 for the performance rate and uh, after that i tried to implement the decision tree classifier and i tried to fit the model um, again and after that uh, i tried to again know that like uh, what is the score on the uh, decision tree classifier and after that i i checked the validation score and uh, again I imported the uh, Ascalon tree and after that I installed uh, uh, Graphis and for that this is the command and uh, after that I tried to like uh, uh, implement the decision tree with the help of tree export Graphis and the dot function. Dot function basically helps in getting the like uh, whatever the data we have in the pictorial representations and uh, for that we have this one and uh, because of some problems in my system i'm not able to run this uh, uh, i'm not able to set the environment variable i don't know there is some issue i will fix it soon and but i don't want to be, uh, more to get late with this uh, this topic uh, for you all because uh, and these these examples is very much uh, like uh, straightforward and uh, you can do it uh, if you have the steps with you in your system so i tried to show you the steps so that at least you can implement on your system but i will fix it soon so this is the like this command will be basically helps in like uh, converting it into a, tr a tree set and uh, after that uh, we have i tried to implement it uh, on the figure size of 15 upon 15 and i named that uh, uh with that i i try to like read this uh, in this this i am read helps to like read the uh that is uh the pick that we have that is the pick of the like this is entry that we have and uh, after that i try to show it with the help of i am show command and uh, you may uh, not be able to like uh, get the things clearly uh, because i'm not these last because of these last two commands i'm not able to show the result but uh, i can surely like uh, show you uh, the result like for like uh, i try to show you this is how the the thing will look like okay that is true false and as we have already said as i have already said that this is a classifier we are implementing classifier and this is how it will look the result will look as you can see we are done with done till here and for these two commands so you can implement like you have to set your graph is in your environment variables and you have to modify the path so that the graph is can be in executed form executable file and dot is the one of the like the, the module that is there in the like uh, in the graph is and from there it will be executable so so after this you will be able to see the results in the in the like decision tree format so so that's all in this video thank you uh, you may liked it and enjoyed it uh, so stay blessed